Nick Bourgeois will kick it off. Jamison Williams to receive. Williams wants to bring it out. Got a seam. Got speed. Got touch at the 35, but stayed up. What a way to start the game. Touchdown, Alabama 100. Is it that he was third on that Ohio State depth chart wasn't really getting the football the skill set is off the charts as soon as he got into green grass there is nobody in the country that is catching number one for Bama. the vision and man after a flat week a win that maybe felt like a loss for a lot of Alabama fans and probably inside that locker room as well what a way to start Southern Miss only brings four. Young to the outside. Caught in Alabama first down. John Mitchie. And second only to Wisconsin coming into this one. Young has time. Pocket holds and he'll float one in for a big time completion to Jaleel Billingsley. Out of the doghouse into the red zone. And he's trying to coordinate against Bill O'Brien. On third and eight to the end zone. Billingsley. Beautiful. Beautiful catch for a touchdown. Well, there you go. The tight end who was third on the depth chart to open the season. Right? You got a team that wants to play up over the top. Great. Take them there and get a man matchup underneath for your athletic tight end in a great ball by Bryce Young, Alabama, 14. Over the middle. That's complete and a tight end. Grayson Gunner will rumble for a first down. Anderson goes inside. Keys once again finds his tight end. Second first down for the Arkansas train. Play action, swing, and that is intercepted off the carom. Picked up by DeMarco Hellams. And Alabama takeaway after Southern Miss had the perfect play drawn up. A great play. Get your quarterback a little bit outside the pocket. He actually misses the read, though. He tries to throw the corner route that was heavily covered. He had a tight end in the flat for an easy 21. And right now, Tennessee leads at Florida by four. Here's Jace McClellan. He's got room on the edge. And McClellan takes it into Southern Miss territory with a 27-yard run. Pressure coming. Young didn't see it till late. Escapes it. Throws wide open Slade Bolden. And Bolden gets wrestled down inside the 30. Goes from a sack to a 20-yard gain. Or he could rip one downfield and really hurt a defense. Here's Mechie looking for a block. He got a couple of them. And then he ducks inside. Pylon. Ball came out and was recovered in the end zone. They say he was down just outside of the goal line, even though Cameron Latou found the loose ball. It's a pickup of 20. Oh, great spin move. And let's see. Yeah, he lost that for sure. The ball was out. It should be a recovery by Latou and a touchdown if they want to stop it. They will not. Yep, they did. After review, video evidence shows that the runner fumbled the ball prior to the goal line. However, it was recovered by a teammate for a touchdown. Again with the ground game and a huge hole for Williams. Stiff arm, pylon out inside the one. A 43-yard run by Roydell Williams. Try it again, and this time he's in. Roydell Williams with the touchdown plunge. This is first for the sophomore from Hueytown.
starting for Tennessee. Bryce Young wanting to go deep. And he's got him. Jamison Williams eating up the yardage again. 81 yard reception. Nick Saban wanted more action and more efficiency on the play action. He got it. Safety's a little lower than they probably would have wanted to be. And you, once you're even as a quarterback, you see Jamison Williams or any of your receivers even, that means he is leaving. Bryce Young, great read, great throw. And let's ride it out. Keys finds the open tight end. It's Gunner again. Somehow got loose for 26. Third catch, third, third down. Keys has a crossing route. This is Jason Brownlee who gets a block and he gets ridden down at about the 11 a gain of 20. Bama trying to preserve the shutout here in the first half. Keys swings it out. Miss tackle Chandler Pittman to the pylon. And they'll say he's out at the one. Stepped out before he made the dive apparently. And DeMarco Ellums came up to try to make this tackle. Pittman got out of it. And let's see. Ooh, ooh, I got a touchdown. I think so. Any part of his body come down out of bounds for the pylon hit? Perhaps oh, the left elbow? Did the ball move? Did he lose control of the ball before he hits the pylon? There's evidence to show that it is a touchdown. I don't agree with that. I don't either. And McClellan has a huge hole over the left side. First down run, gain of 12. Concepts. Young, a play action over the middle. There's Billingsley again. And he sheds a man, stays on his feet, takes it to the 47. It's a pickup of 33. You got players coming and going. And so you can call it the same thing whether you're in the offensive meeting room or the defensive meeting room is that how uncommon is it no it's extremely common that it is from defense to offense even on second and six they'll run it again Roydell Williams and he stumbled over the five yard line 16 yard run that young steps up throws on the run nice move by McClellan touchdown Alabama. On the 10th play of a drive, then once it got in the red zone, went backwards before it went forwards. They just set the bar so high that anytime they're a little bit below that, everybody notices. Well, the running game certainly on par tonight, even if it was. Uh, behind the expectations last week. Golding also put that in perspective. Here's McClellan again. McClellan finds the sideline and he's forced out of bounds. 26 yard run and a flag on the end of that play. End zone shot. Touchdown Cameron Latu. Second of the night. Play action has been near perfection for Alabama tonight. Didn't buy Flow Rugby. Oh, well, you got a Flow Rugby subscription. That's it good. Out, but I did. <laughs> good luck writing that one up. There's Cameron Latu on cue, the product of Salt Lake City. Young on a dime to Billingsley. In his eye formation. Williams has the first down and a little bit more cold. We talked to him about first time ever in Alabama football. You're, you're doing things right. There he is. And it's intercepted off of Williams' hands. Malik Shorts comes up with it. First interception of the year for Bryce Young. And nice run by Chandler Pittman. Helmet popped off at the end of it. Pickup of 11. Guys are going to make some plays for Southern Miss the rest of this year. Move Drew Sanders inside. Keys will take off. He's got a first down run and a slide. Hall got this job and he's decided to stay uh, closer to home and he'll scramble on this one. Nick Saban not happy. 
Keyes steps out of bounds at the 33. Keys to throw. End zone tipped and caught a Southern Miss touchdown for Demarcus Jones. Eleven yard Karam. And it, it was a touch up pass. It wasn't Christian Harris. It was actually Jalen Moody who was spying. You can see 42 right here spying the quarterback. Where is he? Where is he? Gets his hands on the ball and just an unfortunate forward. Well, TJ Finley made plays at the end of that game when he had to, so you got to imagine. Here's a playmaker, Jamison Williams again. Uh, on the oh. run again. Down the sideline. It's his second kickoff return for a score of the night. That was nearly 83 yards after a 100 yard return to open the game. combination of vision and then that's just speed I mean nobody is catching number one when he's at his top end speed right there so they missed a 1982 Reggie Collier did the damage deep ball grabbed high point by Javon Baker and a 34 yard completion three yards away from being the second 100 yard rusher Tyson got hit as he threw wide open there's another first down it's Cameron lot to making big moves down the sideline when we talk to O'Brien and he's going to go deep into the end zone a flag on the play and it's caught by Baker 24 yard touchdown strike Bill O'Brien said if you're a quarterback and you don't understand protections, you can't play. He's proven that tonight he can't play. Yeah, and a blitz coming up the middle, understood that it was going to get picked up. And then throws a great dart to the outside to Baker. Who fights through the hand, really hand checking there from Rayshon Mitchell on the outside.